Hello valued viewers, I hope you're all doing very well. It's August 2022. Since I last looked at the hind, loads of cool stuff has been added. It's my fault, I just haven't kept up with Eagle Dynamics modules for reasons. But two really cool things have been added. One, we can now have AI and human gunners added to the aircraft. Also, even more importantly, we can now carry infrared air-to-air -air missiles. We can have a cord 12.7 mil gunner in either the left or right side of the fuselage and for reasons that I don't fully understand I believe left is the better side. Is that correct Dan? As far as turning rate, yes. So I like to have my gunner on the left side so I can do my turn rate perfectly. Next I'm going to add my R60Ms. These are modernized R60 air-to-air -air missiles. Stations currently two and five. We can have one or two per station. Note, in later updates we will be able to have more than four, I think up to eight, but for the time being, four. There we can see the R60Ms, and here is our cord. First, let's do the R60Ms. So, I'm gonna show the minimum amount of button presses you can do to get them working. So, first of all, we'll need to your weapon systems on. And if you remember, you do that with that button there. So let's press that, ping, weapon systems are turning on. Next, I'm gonna get rid of my stick. I'm gonna turn my master arm on and my sight on. Over to my air-to-air -air missile panel, which is here. I want to power it on and check the light. Note, at the moment, we can only use the missile in air-to-air. -air. In future expansions, we will also be able to shoot ground targets, which will be very interesting. You have to select which station you want to fire the missiles from. So, in the default position it's off, we're gonna select one. That is these left two missiles. If we want to then fire the right two missiles, two. Three and four are the other stations that are not yet activated and will come later. Next, we have to wait for the seekers and the weapon system to be essentially warmed up and ready. We're gonna wait until seeker operational shows here and yellow light. So we'll just skip time forward until that is ready. Okay, it's on. Needless to say, we need to point the reticle here at a heat source, and when we're within range, we'll get a lock-on cue here, a green light, and a tone. And then, obviously, we just press that button there to fire the missile. So, ah, there is a very, very well-placed Bob. I'm gonna try and get him. Ha <laughs> ha Got him! That was what we call excellent timing. Note these missiles are actually relatively old, even though they're modernized and they can be spoofed pretty easily by flares. Uh, why not? Let's just shoot Grump here. That's an excellent example. Hey, Grump, and firing. Okay, well spoofed. Everything's working well today. Next, I need to change over to Launcher 2. Next, let's try the Cord Gunner. Welcome back. So, next. The cord gunner currently on the left side can either be driven by AI or human. We will show both. So, AI, all you need to do is press left shift and H, left shift and hotel. That brings up the crew status bar, which you can just about see there. Trying to get pilot is obviously the player. Gunner is currently AI. His ROE is hold fire. If I want to change that, I'm going to press left control windows and three because he's actually position number three in my helicopter let's change him to return fire and finally free fire just cycle through them do i want him to use short bursts or long bursts i'm going to change it to long with left shift left win and three he is now on long burst uh it's literally as simple as that i'm now going to fly and try and find a bad guy to shoot note that he will shoot air targets as well. An air target can make himself available. Are there any more AI left up, guys? Oh, it's going already. Yep. Mine's going already. He's shooting Grump. Do you see him? I see you. Hello, he's ah! shooting Grump. That's so funny. That's awesome. Awesome, guys. Uh, right, next thing, I'm going to jump in one of you guys' uh, PvP slots. So, come out to here. I'm going to choose, I think, Mr. Sock. I'm going to be the cord gunner. I could obviously be the co-pilot. Sock, let me in, please. Briefing. Okay. Uh, here I am. There's not much to say. The only button I need is one button. If I go to that one there, gunner, 
there, machine gun fire. I'm using track IR and because I'm using track IR, it automatically sets me up so that I can move it around with my head. So that's how I aim it. If I didn't have track IR, I wouldn't actually know how to move this about. But that's the method I've got at the moment. Okay, press space. It fires the gun and automatically reloads. Oh, isn't that convenient? A wild grump has appeared. Oh, and of course he doesn't have his canopy on. Sir, pull over this helicopter. We believe it is stolen. I can't hear you. Please come a little bit closer, Grum. License and registration. Just a little bit closer. I've got this trick I want to show you. <laughs> oh, is it a license and registration? Um, okay. Yeah, yep. I'm showing it on my window right Guess now. Some. Ah, ah. Oh, shh. stay there. Stay there. Stay there. I forgot to reload. Small <laughs> piglet wheel. License and registration. Yeah, got it. Go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. run. He's trying to come after us. Wee woo, wee woo, wee woo. Uh oh, I'm actually dead. <laughs> <laughs> you win this I time. Shot him. I shot him down. I shot him. Oh, that makes me feel good inside, and that's a very rare feeling nowadays. Oh, boys. This is my boys being boys, I'm afraid. Sorry to have fun, and this video game is not made for fun, but. Uh, that is air to air missiles as they are now. That is called AI and that is called human, which actually makes me want to fly this again. Not that I ever did want to fly it, uh, not want to fly it, because it's actually really good. I've got nothing else to say, it's just really cool. And look, I can see in the cabin. We toot, we toot. One more thing I just noticed if you go in single player, remember you can be the pilot by pressing one, you can be forward gunner by pressing two, and if you press three on the keyboard in single player, you can be the gunner. And even cooler than that, if you go back to the pilot seat and you fly a bit, just get it very roughly straight and level. Now press three. You can now be the gunner as a human in single player while the AI now flies the helicopter. Get some. Get some. Hope that was useful and see you later.